it's finally time for the 32 teams in 32 days series here at the MJ Take here at Sports Fan Entertainment. Hello and welcome. For those of you that were subscribed to me last season, you remember this. If you subscribed since then, you don't. Let me explain to you what's about to go down. So starting July 25th, for each and every team in the NFL, I will be uploading my win-loss predictions in which... I give you my win-loss predictions, as well as my thoughts on each roster and the schedule and the coaching and the owners and whatever the hell else, you know, dictates my prediction. I'll be previewing each and every team in the NFL for the 32 days from July 25th to August 25th. I moved it up. Last year, I started August 1st, but this year, I'm deciding to move it up, and I have the full video schedule down in the description box below every single day at 7 p.m. Central Time, 8 o'clock Eastern, 5 o'clock Pacific, 6 o'clock Mountain. You can expect a new team up on this channel, so you know where to go. You know where to be. It's going to be here on this freaking channel, so watch the damn video, even if it's not your favorite team. Now, let me just say this. I I dare you. I, I beg you. I beg you. Because here's the problem with this, okay? Everyone hates my predictions, for the most part. And that's fine. You know, you're allowed to have that. I, I really don't care. The thing is, though, I challenge you to make your own predictions. But when you do, list all the teams, right? Like how I'm going to do. Give out 256 wins and give out 256 losses. And I'm telling you, it ain't easy because you have to pick at least 10 to 15 to even, you can even go high, you can go 18 or 20 if you wanted to, teams and say you're losing more games. And it's not easy to do. And then you have to take, you know, another 10 to 15 teams and say you're winning more games. And it's very easy to say the other one. I mean, you can pick 20 teams and say you're winning more games, but mathematically it doesn't work out. Or you can just do it this way, which is a little bit harder. You can literally just go through the schedules and start saying win-loss, 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 and counting it up, and you're going to be like, damn, I have the Titans going 2-14. and 14. I don't think they're going to go 2-14. and 14. It's tough. It's not easy. So with that in mind, just, you know, look out because some of my predictions you're not going to like, but I'm trying to, I try to keep everything mathematically sound. So go through the schedules and figure out, really give out 256 wins, 256 losses, and you'll understand, yeah, these predictions aren't really that bad because they're mathematically sound. I can come on here and give out 300 wins. I'll have everybody do doing better than 6 and 10. Okay, no one's pissed. And then like the Browns would be the worst team in the league at 6 and 10. The 49ers would be the second worst team at 7 and 9. And then a lot of 10 and 6 teams and it just doesn't work. It's not mathematically sound. Everyone's happy. Everyone watches my video and likes me, but who cares? You know, we're trying to be in, we're trying to have some sort of integrity here. So, you can look forward to your video. You can look forward to when I I discuss your team. But don't be surprised when I have a prediction that is lower than yours because I almost guarantee, I almost guarantee it will be lower than yours. But with that said, let's enjoy ourselves. 32 teams in 32 days beginning July 25th. This has been the MJ Take here on Sports Fan Entertainment. And until next time, I'm out.